Sammy order from Uber Eats, you may have your food delivered by a robot. So the company is bringing this new technology to the East Coast for the very first time. Fox Eyes Antoine Lewis gives us a close-up look at how exactly it works. Food delivery is now firmly in the 21st century. Uber Eats customers in Jersey City can soon choose to have a robot deliver their food. We really match with what's going to be best for the customer experience, whether that's a robot or a human courier. We also are thinking about the communities that we serve. All of these vehicles are electric vehicles, and also they help with road congestion on the streets as well. When making an order on Uber Eats, customers will have the option to select traditional human delivery or delivery from a driverless robot made by the company AV Ride. Customers can then track the robot through the Uber Eats app. Restaurants lock the food order inside the robot. Once it arrives, measures are in place to ensure it's delivered to the correct recipient. It doesn't unlock until it reaches the customer, and only the customer is able to unlock it within the Uber Eats app by clicking unlock. So no one is able to get into the compartment, and that's how we're able to avoid any sort of tampering with their food in the robot. And the cost of this high-tech delivery service? There is no additional cost. It's the same delivery fee as a human courier. If a customer does add a tip onto the order, then and they're matched with a delivery robot, then that tip is refunded, so it's not charged. Uber Eats says the robots have a range of up to 31 miles and can travel up to five miles an hour on one charge. The robots can deliver in good and bad weather, including snow. The service is currently available in Dallas and Austin. Jersey City is its first East Coast market. The thought was that you know, it's a densely populated area. We have uh, infrastructure like bike lanes, wider sidewalks, um, deliveries robust down here. So it's a good opportunity to learn. And uh, that's what we're trying to do. And that's why, uh, you know, we're, we're excited to partner with them. Right now, the service is available from 11 to 9 in downtown Jersey City with plans to gradually expand. From Jersey City, Antoine Lewis, Fox 5 News.